I'm going to talk about my workout because you know how when you watch people work out on a lot of videos and TV, it's like skinny, already fit people working out, you know, and you watch them for a few minutes and you're just like, hmm. instead of being inspiring, it's actually a little depressing because they already have their perfect body and I, I, I'm not taking anything away from them. I'm sure they worked hard to get that. But still, I don't really want to watch them when they're working out. And also, uh, you know, it's not, it's just not me. It's not where I am on my journey. So anyway, I'm going to show you what I do to work out. First of all, you know, working out is a sweaty job. So you're not going to look all gorgeous like them with their makeup on, their hair all perfect and this like cute little suit. You're just going to have to realize it's you're gonna be like sweaty ugly miserable and just go with it because that's just the truth of it so what I do is I put my hair up because if you're not sweating and really hot when you're working out you're not working out hard enough so don't try to be all gorgeous don't try to be like all makeup and cute just you know pretty much get comfortable because it's going to be you know you're going to be hot and sweaty so who cares what you look at like while you're working out later you know once you have a better body then you can dress up that'll be the time so put your hair up get a sweat rag because you know if you're going to be sweating a lot so what i do is i do my elliptical and at first you know you get on you're almost kind of rickety but I have been doing it long enough. I used to do 30 minutes six days a week. Then I, then I dropped down to 30 minutes five days a week when I started doing weights. But then I was like feeling kind of fatigued all the time because I still have a, lot, have a lot of stuff to do. So I'm, I am active. So then I'm like, oh, okay, I gotta drop it down. I dropped it down to 30 minutes three days a week and added in the weightlifting three days a week but then I'm like mm, I, I don't feel like that's enough I need more cardio so I wanted to do cardio five days a week for sure so I dropped it down eight minutes a day I'm doing 22 minutes a day of cardio five days a week and lifting weights three days a week and that feels pretty good right now you know obviously as you gain strength and lose weight you could probably do more but you gotta find your level so right now that's my level when I do this elliptical, it is like um, interval training. It starts out kind of easy, then it goes like a little harder, then it goes way up hard, and then, you know, it drops down a little bit, and then like a little cool down point, and then I'm done. So um, that's what I do. And then I just program it, and then I just get going. Once I start, that's it. I try just to give it all, give it my all for 22 minutes, you know, like, have good posture, you know, try to keep your head up a little bit and put a little effort into it. I, I don't want to just be on here like, oh, I'm dying. I can barely do it. Like, I'm going to try to give it my all for 22 minutes. And like I said, you definitely get really hot and really sweaty. But I mean, that's the whole point. So it's only 22 minutes and I can do it. 22 minutes done. It's really hard. I brought a little over 250 calories, which isn't much, but if you add it up over the five day period, it ends up being quite a bit. Plus, you add that to, you know, how many calories you're cutting every day in your, you know, calorie intake, and that does add up to a weight loss. Next, I'm gonna do my weights. But before I do that, what I wanna tell you is, um, you know what, before I got on the elliptical, I said, try to do your best and just give it your all. But in the very beginning, you know, I started out with 20 minutes and it was hard and I went slow, but I was just determined to do the 20 minutes. I didn't care like how slow I did it. Like I could barely do it, but I was like, I'm not giving up. I'm going to do the whole 20 minutes. And I did. And it's surprising how fast you build up your stamina from there. If you just stick with it, like surprisingly fast. So that's what I that's what I want to tell is don't give up. Like even if you have to do it super super slow, just do the 20 minutes. Don't give up. 
Okay, next I'm going to show you the weightlifting I do, which isn't like some phenomenal thing, but still I want to show you what I do. Because the weightlifting gives you shape, you know, the cutting calories in your meals and the elliptical, you know, that burns calories, but that doesn't give you any shape. And when you're losing weight, obviously you need to like, you know, kind of shape things up a little <laughs> so it looks better. So I'm going to show you that next. All right, so what I use are these 15 pound dumbbells. See the 15? 15, which is really heavy. So, but use whatever size you can lift, you know, go to 10 or five or whatever, but I, I want to use these heavy ones and I'm pretty strong so I can lift these up pretty easy. Okay, so today the part I work on is gonna be, these are like lunges. So I go like this, and I'm using this 15 pound weight while I'm holding it. Okay, so while I do that, I'm trying to suck my stomach in as hard as I can. And believe me, you will feel those the next day. So I'm gonna do three sets of those. I do three sets of 18. Okay, that's really, really hard. One thing I didn't know in the beginning is you can't do 18 and then like sit on the sofa and watch TV for a little while and then get up and do 18 more. Cause that's how I used to be. That's how I started. And it does build you up. But I guess, like, you're not really supposed to do it that way. You're not supposed to wait more than a minute in between. So, that makes it way harder if you, ha you can't, like, sit down and take a rest. But whatever. You know, something is better than nothing. So, if you have to start out, I mistakenly did it. And it still made me stronger. So, you know, you don't have to be perfect. You don't have to be crazy about it. Okay, the next one I do is I get two of them. Now I do this for my sides. I guess it works that right in there, your muscles. So, well, actually I'll use one at a time. Okay, so I do that, and then I just like do side lifts, kind of. Okay, there's 18. I do 18 on both sides and then I do three sets of those as well. Now the next one I do is arm curls. This one's kind of hard too because these are heavy weights. I only do 12 of these because that is freaking heavy. Okay, so now I'm going to do bench presses, which is really hard. And I can only do 16 of those at a time, so I'm going to do two more reps of that. Alrighty, my last one. Oh, I'm tired. Okay, these are like back arm lifts, which I need these really bad. I'm going to scoot to the end because this is going to work my fat arms, the back of my fat arms, which I love these. I try to keep my elbows in and just lift.
And I do 18 of those and three reps.